everyone. If you're new to my channel, I am Trishawn, owner of Big New Hair Extensions. I sell raw Indian hair, and I will be adding some new raw hair textures to the website soon, so you can look forward to that. You can go to BigDoHairExtensions.com. Um, although I do sell raw textures of hair, that is not what I'm here to talk about today. I'm actually here to talk about natural hair. So I've um, been uploading a lot of content talking about my natural hair because I feel that it's very important to not only take care of your hair extensions, but hello, we got to take care of the hair under our hair extensions, okay? What is the point of taking care of somebody else's hair and the person our own? Nah, we're not doing that. So, over the past um, almost a month now, I've been using the rice water and I've used it twice. So I've been doing it every other week. The first time I used it, um, I used it after I had washed my hair and I can't remember if I had put the conditioner on before the rice water or after that process, but I'll put the link to that video below and it'll tell you all about it. But I did spray it, so I poured the rice water in a spray bottle and I sprayed it on my hair and after that first use, my hair did feel a little bit kind of rough to me oh i love your picture this is my daughter thank you can you draw me some more please mm -hmm. thank you gotta keep her busy or she'll be all up in our video but again my hair felt a little bit crunchy that was just my first time using it um the second time which was two weeks later i had the uh video for that I'll actually put that video also in the description what I did was because I didn't like that kind of uh, rough crunchy feeling what I did was I went on and conditioned my hair and then I added the rice water on while the conditioner was on and still I can kind of feel that roughness so I really do believe what happened was the rice water actually did kind of deposit maybe a film from the rice onto my hair which is kind of causing it to kind of feel that kind of rough texture oh my gosh baby girl i love it i love it you do a great job high five thank you all right can you draw me some more please thank you um so yeah so my opinion of the rice water i know you guys would know if it you know helped me achieve hair growth I really can't say that I, I, I don't know I feel like my hair has grown but I can't say 100% for sure that it was from the rice water um, so I don't know guys I don't know I know there's a lot be careful baby um, I know there's a lot of talk about the rice water I know there's a lot of hype about the rice water but as of right now I just I, I can't say 100% that I did achieve growth from the rice water. Sorry guys. Um, yeah, I don't know. I do feel like maybe people say that the rice water helps them to achieve length because of, maybe maybe because of the coating, you know, maybe the coating does provide some type of protection to the hair strands, possibly, I'm not sure. Um, but as for me, I just can't get past the kind of the way my hair texture felt after putting it on it so I would not be using that anymore but I did want to try it I did want to see what the hype was about and I did want to share my experience with you guys so I decided to go ahead and get my hair curled and I'm feeling these curls yes natural shine and body I love it curls for the girls curls for the girls it's always a mystery. Hold on, baby. It's always a mystery how I'm going to get my hairstyle next. I never, like, really know. It's always fun. Being a woman is fun, okay? Changing up my hair is fun. I love my hair extensions, and I love my natural hair. And what I do want to get through to you all is that although I promote hair extensions over here, although I love my hair extensions, I want you guys to know that I love my natural hair and I want for you guys to love your natural hair as well. So in 2020, 
let's take care of our natural hair, let's rock our wigs, but let's take care of our hair under the wigs because we can get all the sew-ins we want, we can wear all the wigs we want, but if we're not maintenancing our natural hair, all these protective styles will mean nothing because guess what? Our hair going to be breaking off. It's not going to, I mean, it's not going to be growing. We're not going to see the growth because the hair going to be falling out. So we have to protect our natural hair strands and that is what I want to promote over here. Because I have seen, I have seen some things, okay? And I don't want for my customers to be looking crazy. I want you to have all your edges, okay? I want your hair to grow, right? Your natural hair. So if you want to take your wig off and show them that you, you know what I'm saying, long hair don't care, you got that option. So I did want to start bringing you guys content about my natural hair because people have this misconception that if you wear um, weave and things like that, that you don't like your natural hair. And that is such a myth because I do love my hair. And that is all that I have for you guys today. So if you have any questions, comments, go ahead and leave them below. And as I've stated before, I will put the links to those other videos below so that you can um, go back and see exactly what I'm talking about if you hadn't had a chance to look at those um, natural hair videos featuring the rice water. So thank you so much for watching and take care of that natural hair.